The Bookstore Burglar. Chapter 1. Mr. Brown owned a store. It was not just any store. It was a bookstore. It was called the Black Cat Bookstore. Mr. Brown lived above the store with his cat, Cobweb. Cobweb was not just any cat. Her best friends were mice. Her favorite food was cheese. Every morning, Mr. Brown and Cobweb ate cheese for breakfast. Then they went downstairs to open the store. The Black Cat Bookstore was not just any bookstore. It sold only ghost books. It even had a ghost. Chapter 2 Cobweb liked to walk around the store. She helped Mr. Brown keep an eye on things. One day, Cobweb saw something strange. The spare key was not on its hook. Then, Cobweb saw a man with the key. He was putting it in his pocket. The man walked toward the door. Only Cobweb knew what he had done. Stop him! Cobweb said to the ghost, He's a burglar! Bang! A book dropped on the man's head. Ouch! He yelled. Everyone came to see what had happened. Cobweb stayed beside the empty hook. She meowed. But Mr. Brown didn't notice her. I'm very sorry, Mr. Brown told the man. My ghost made a mistake. What ghost? said the man. This bookstore has a ghost, said a boy. It is a friendly ghost. Huh, I don't believe in ghosts, said the man. He left the store. Chapter 3 Mr. Brown was busy all day. He did not notice the empty hook. At the end of the day, he closed the blinds. Then he locked the door. Cobweb meowed. She jumped up by the hook. She patted it. I'm too tired to play, said Mr. Brown. I'm going upstairs. Cobweb stayed downstairs. She thought the burglar might come back. It grew darker and darker. Then she heard a key in the lock. That must be the burglar, said Cobweb. Are you ready, ghost? Chapter 4 The burglar tiptoed across the store. He had a flashlight. Bang! A book fell off the shelf beside him. I don't believe in ghosts said the burglar. Bang! Cobweb shook the blinds with her paws. Rattle, rattle! The burglar dropped his flashlight. Nice, ghosty, he said. Rattle, rattle! Sss, hissed Cobweb. Bang! went the books. Rattle, rattle! went the blinds. Help! yelled the burglar. Rattle, rattle. Bang. Help. Chapter 5. Mr. Brown came downstairs. What's all this noise? He asked. He turned on the light and saw the burglar. Your ghost is not friendly, yelled the burglar. He ran out of the store. Mr. Brown saw the spare key in the door. He saw the empty hook. So that's how the burglar got in, he said. You tried to warn me. Thank you, Cobweb. Thank you too, ghost, he told the mice. It's late. You must be hungry. Everyone follow me. They went upstairs to the kitchen. Mr. Brown made a treat. It was not just any treat. It was a cheese treat. I hope you like it, he said. They did. They did.